and you know what time it is. It's up, it's up, it's up. It's not gym time. <laughs> it's actually, oh, that's what I said on my water bottle. It's actually not gym time, but I'm actually gonna be doing a Q&A for you guys um, because I have a lot of questions regarding my diet, my exercise, my workouts, um, and just some personal questions about me. So um, let's not waste any time. The biggest mistake when you, uh, you made when you started lifting. So um, I would say my biggest mistake, I personally made not asking enough questions. I didn't ask questions to people because I was scared. I was the best foods uh, recommended that I recommend to eat uh, before working out. Um, I recommend no food. <laughs> For, so my workouts are basically fasted. What inspired you to start working out? Huh. I think I answered this in uh, one of my earlier YouTube videos, but um, what inspired me to start working out was um, one of my really good friends um, asked me a question. And he's like a very successful guy, whatever. But he asked me a question, and that really stuck to me. And um, he said, what are you most passionate about? And I found out it was, um, you know, working out was my passion. Um, next question is, how do you get all the nutrients uh, by eating a meal every 12 hours? So the nutrients I get is through my foods. Um, also, I get, like, I take a lot of stuff. It says, when did you feel... Ooh. Feelings. <laughs> Okay, so when did you feel you were at your lowest and why? And what did you do to overcome that obstacle and what advice would you give to those who are facing their worst obstacle at the moment? And then she, I'll need some water for this because, yeah. Um, there was a point in my life and usually I've noticed a lot of people have that point in their life, you know what I mean? Um, where I felt I was at my lowest like I was in a very low point it was mentally physically emotionally like all the lees you could possibly think of without getting into too much detail about it um, I was around nine or ten years old and a big thing happened to me that changed my life forever and um, it was an incident and everyone has those, like they have incidents. And after that, I started going through a lot of depression and a lot of, um, I was very at a low point in my life and I didn't know what to do, right? And so, um, uh, I was very, um, I have low self-esteem. I had uh, very insecure. I was, I didn't know what I was, I knew I was gonna get through it and I got through it. And later on, this ties in with lifting, I found my passion for lifting. So, if you're going through a low point in your life, I, the only suggestion or advice I would give you, and I'm no expert, honestly, I'm no expert, so the only advice I would give a person is that the way out anything is the way through it and everyone has like these like self this moments and self that moments and whatever so um you just need to know that you will get through it and you'll come out the other side swinging you'll be swinging on that shit just kidding um <laughs> i'm sorry you can't take me seriously and like you gotta make everything light. If you, what I've learned over the years and you know, my whole experience of life, cause I'm you know, <laughs> old as fuck, like, no. um, what I've learned over the years is that you have to take life very lightly. And if you don't take it lightly, you will be sucked into this, this whatever it is, and it's gonna suck for you. So anyway, so if you're going through some tough times in your life, Go to the gym, bitch. No, go hit the gym. Do something fun. You know, make some. You have to do something light. Anyways, that's it, guys, for the Q and A. Um, I am 
off to see the wizard's like no ah uh, <laughs> i'm gonna go and uh i will see you guys later anyways ch 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 ch